Hey guys, just a quick video for you today and if you like what you see don't forget to hit the like button and if you want more tools and streaming gear reviews please subscribe to the channel. If you're a multi-streamer looking for a tool to have all your chats in one view, recently I've created a dashboard in which you can view your Twitch, YouTube, TikTok and Kick chat in. All you need to do is head across to streamchat.colinhorn.co.uk and you'll be met with this page here. Don't worry, there's no usernames info on it yet, so don't worry about the cookie banner on Twitch, you can reject it or accept it, or don't worry about the YouTube column. What you then want to do is hit the cog icon up here on the top right, and then input your usernames for Twitch, TikTok, and Kick. If you're not needing to use the platform, just click on the enable toggle under the service and it will hide it for you. For your YouTube live stream, what you need to do is head to YouTube first and start up a live stream. And then you want to copy the URL of this live stream and paste it into the YouTube section. As I'm only embedding this using an iframe and not going through the API, the tool is not able to pick up on your latest video. Sadly, YouTube's live system changes the URL every single time you go live, so you have to update this each time you do so. And also, if you're met with this error for TikTok, don't worry, it's just a limitation on the API. Wait a couple of minutes and then refresh the page again. And it's as easy as that. Since my original tweet went out, there's been a couple of questions that have been asked. Well, like I said, until I implement the YouTube API properly, it's just an embedded iframe, sadly, so this is not possible. Um, and this is a limitation of how YouTube pretty much manages their live streams. Even though once I may have implemented the YouTube API, I don't know how easy it's going to be to do this. So keep an eye out for that, please. This is something I want to bring in, which is going to be an optional YouTube column, basically meaning that there's going to be a, a disabled one by default, but you'll be able to enable it and you can put in two different YouTube URLs, allowing for both chats at the same time on this dashboard. This is something I really do want to bring in and I don't know whether or not it's going to be through drag and drop uh, just by grabbing the tab or if it's going to be an ordering thing within the systems panel. Um, I think I think it might be drag and drop in the end, but it's definitely something I want to have a look into. Anyway, guys, that's it all from me today. If you have any other features you'd like to see on this chat dashboard, let me know down below in the comments and I shall see you in the next video. Until then, I'll catch you later. See ya.